Alright, today we are going to learn how to change our background image. I'm going to open Composer and first I'm going to show you how you are going to set your preferences before you create your web page. We are going to select here tools and select options and we are going to select new page settings. By default it is selected readers default colors but we need to select use custom colors if we want to set preferences to be default when we create our pages. As you can see you can change a text color, link color, active link, visited link text and this is where we are going to select our default background color. Let's say that we want this blue as it is select OK and select OK. We are going to select here format and page colors and background and we are going to change this color to white now and select here OK and select OK. Our background is white now. This is how we change background colors but if you want image to be your background, good practice is to create a logo 50 pixels by 50 pixels and set that as your background. Why so small? Because your page will load faster. And this is how we are going to do that. Again, format, page colors and background. But this time we are going to select here background image and as you can see this is where we choose our file. And let's say that I want this small image to be my background. Let's say that this is the logo that I created. And if you can't find your files, this is one useful thing to know. You will select here all files. And let's say that I want this image. Select open and select OK. This is how it looks now. Let's go to this other page. One more option for background image, if you want bigger size image to be your background, let's say 2000 pixels by 1000 pixels, you will download EarthenU and install right plugin and you will save this file for web because that will reduce the size of your file and your page will load faster and let's change this background image now. We are going again in format, page colors and background, again background image, choose file and this time we are going to choose this image and select open and select OK. As you can see this background image is not moving. Usually when you have this big big image it uh, repeats itself and to avoid that and to have fixed background image this is the code that you will paste into into your web page we are going to switch here to source and you will find closing head tag and beginning of the body tag this is the code that you are going to insert Write it down somewhere on your notepad and save it in your project folder. This is the code and this is where you are going to paste this code. You will see here style equal open speech marks and this is the code that is inserted. Make sure you get all the code. Don't forget anything otherwise it won't work. Let's see now how this looks if we open it in in browser and this is how you can open your pages that you just created of course don't forget to save it and let's see index right click open with Google Chrome and this is now our index page where logo is our background and let's see here our other. Let's refresh this, our other page. And this is how our other page looks like. You see, if I scroll down, background image is 
fixed. I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, of course don't forget to have a great day. Bye!